Coastal Carolina coming off a loss on Tuesday to UNC Asheville. The Chanticleers responded in a big way on Saturday afternoon at Kimball. Let's check out the action between CCU and Radford. Sam McLaurin was honored prior to the game as the school's all-time leader in block shots, and he didn't disappoint early on. McLaurin slams one down here. It was a tight game until the seven-minute mark of the first half where the Chanticleers go on a major run, and it was sparked by Anthony Rafa. The junior from New Jersey had 13 points in the first half, and Coastal had an 18-point lead at the half. They didn't let up in the second half. The lead never got below double digits. Rafa would finish with 28 points. That ties a career high. Kier Greenwood had 17 as the Shana Clears Cruise to an 82-62 win. CCU is now 14-5 on the season, 7-2 in Big South play. My teammates helped, uh, got me involved tonight, and, you know, the offense was just, just flowing, and, you know, we... Everybody was getting touches, and you know, I was looking for them. They were looking for me. It's just, it's a good win for our whole team. Well, it's a long season. Oh, and you got to throw losses away, but you got to throw wins away too. I mean, this was fine. Sleep on it, but tomorrow you better be thinking about next week. The coach and I break down Radford and everything CCU basketball on the Cliff Ellis Show Sunday at noon, right here on News Channel 15 in Conway. I'm Rich Crampanis, News Channel 15 Sports.